making use of the technical resources that we have and of course from manufacturing the supercharger drive which brings very good margin but longer term the future of the company is from revenues from production for the introduction of the supercharger drive into the tuning market we're working with a company in Detroit wheel to wheel who are part of the textile organization they're very strong in developing supercharger kits already and by adding the two-speed option it gives them another product to offer. Well, what really excites us about the Antonov unit is that it allows a lot more low-end um, feel for the driver when they first step on the pedal and giving it a lot more tire screeching grunt that traditionally centrifugal superchargers did not uh, provide. The Chinese market is particularly suitable for our technology because it's a strong market for automatic gearboxes. This demand is very important to us. We have, for some years now, been working with and talking to most of the major car makers in the world. The problem with them is that they don't develop new gearboxes very often. If I go to them and say, you know, do you like our new gearbox? They can say yes, but the next time we develop an all new design may be five, six, seven years away. The Chinese need the technology today, and that makes it very attractive to us. We don't stop to invent, and our program for the future cannot be disclosed, but there is already invention which we hide in the moment that we can run the development and continue to introduce our technology in an even wider range of applications. Two-speed transmission option for it by Antonov. Why don't we go take a look? What really makes the supercharger unique is it has an outer annulus ring that's ordinarily driven one-to-one -one by the drive pulley, which then is in contact through a thin layer of traction fluid film to three rollers that are in a planetary configuration with a sun shaft down the center which attaches to an impeller. That allows us to run, or allows the Rotrex to run much higher impeller speeds and use an actual turbocharger technology and turbocharger impeller housing which allows it to make more power for its size, allows it to be more efficient and what we really like is that it's very very quiet. Uh, none of the blower whine because there's no gears in it. Another new option just pretty much showing this year is an Antonov two-speed transmission. This actually becomes part of the supercharger and allows the supercharger to be spun 36% above what it would ordinarily be on the lower half of the RPM band and then automatically shift, providing quite a bit more low-end torque. 